If you want to give handmade gifts to your loved ones, here is something which can be used daily and is super easy to make. You can also use it as a night lamp for yourself. Let's get right into it. For this lamp, a cardboard box like this is needed. It is my laptop's charger box. Before starting, make sure that it can be open along any one of its sides. Now, we are going to draw some patterns on all the lateral sides which will guide us during the cutting process. Select a shape according to your wish. It can be stars or hearts or whatever you like. I am drawing hearts. I cut out the shape of my pattern in a cardboard piece to use it as a stencil while drawing so that all the shapes would be of same size. Please keep in mind that the shapes should be small in size because the dispersion of light will make it large already. Big size shape will not give a good result. The greater the distance between the walls and the lamp, the smaller the shapes should be. I used a box cutter to cut the patterns from the cardboard and after a few hours and some patience, it's done. I took this cardboard piece with size equal to a few mm less than the diagonal of my box. You will know the need in few minutes. I colored the inner sides of the box with white color to allow maximum reflection of lights. Color the outside of the box with any dark color of your choice. I am using black. You can see that I am using fabric colors because apparently they provide a better matte finish look. You can also use glitters to decorate it. I am keeping it plain and simple. Let's move on to the electronics part. We will need a LED strip of warm white color. I am using a 5630 version which I bought online. It came with a crappy power supply but will work here because I am not going to use the whole 5 meter of the strip. I will mount the LED strips on both the sides of the cardboard piece I showed earlier like this. So I cut two pieces from the strip after measuring it. I peeled off the covering tape from its back and stick it to the cardboard. Short the positive and negative terminals of both the strips using a wire. I used 0.75 square mm solid wire. Now we will connect the power supply to the strip. For that, I will solder AC input to these two wires and LED strips to these two wires. I use shrinking tubes for insulation. It's time to assemble both the pieces to make a piece of beauty. I slide the prepared cardboard with LED strips along the diagonal of the box. I check the LED driver before installing. Make sure not to short the voltage terminals. Then I fix the LED driver on top. As its covering was taking more space, I removed it. I made a niche on the top to pass AC wires and soldered the AC wires to AC input of the power supply and then hot glued it. Then I connected the power supply to a wall outlet and fair enough, it lights up. The final result is just a treat twice. So go ahead and make one of this as a gift to someone, I'm sure they'll like it. And if you like this video, don't forget to hit like button below and consider subscribing as more videos are on their way. Thank you guys for watching, till next time.